Ibadan, Oyo State Capital. It is located in southwest region of Nigeria. It is the third most populous city in Nigeria, coming after Lagos and Kano. It is mostly inhabited by Yoruba tribe. The city of Ibadan is known for its brown roof and old structure. Well, believe me when I say there is more to Ibadan than just brown roof. Ibadan is a beautiful city and there are so many places to visit in the course of your stay there. Aside for fun and realization, one comes out richer in the knowledge about Yoruba culture and the history of Ibadan people. So today we are going to explore Ibadan. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe, like, thanks. Number 1. Boaz Toa. It is located on top of Ukiare Hill, the highest hill of the city. See it at an over 60 feet tall Toa. Now, the unique experience visiting this Toa gives you a breathtaking view of the city. Rising up about 60 feet gives you a vantage view of the site of Ibadan. Arriving at the top of the Toa, one gets a panoramic view of the Kukuo House, the University College Hospital, the Bear Market, Agudi Garden, Lagos Ibadan Express to Gate, and of course, the signature brand roofs. This is undoubtedly a fun place to hang out in Ibadan. The famous Bowa Toa serves as watchtower during the days of colonization. It enabled the guards and soldiers to observe what was going on in the city from a vantage point. The toa is open from about 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and it costs about 200 naira to get entrance. One can decide to, aside of enjoying the view, to have a picnic or create a social media content like taking pictures and videos there. Number 2. Agodi Garden it is known as Agodin Zoological and Botanical Garden. See it at the foot of Old Mokala Hill. For a fun free day and amazing variety of activities, Agodi Garden is a place to be. The garden has a perfect picnic arena. There is a grand swimming area and inflatable boat with which one can spend some moment floating on water. The garden hosts a couple of attractions that ensure your visit is pleasurable, among which include a mini zoo, water park, and a ride for children. Agodin Garden is a fun place to hang out in Ibadan. It's located at Mokola Ibadan and it was created in 1967. Walking into this garden is free, but one must hire to pay for facilities to be used in this garden. Some of the fun activities that can be engaged in this garden include picnic, taking pictures or videos, taking pre wedding pictures and video, get together and small gathering. Number 3. Kuku House Kuku House is the tallest building in Ibadan. It stands at 105 meters tall, comprises of 26 stories. It was once the tallest building in West Africa. Its initial name was Ile Aon Agbe, meaning the House of Farmers. It is located in Dubia area in Ibadan. In January 1985, the building was gutted with fire, but it has been renovated and opened for commercial use. The last floor is reserved from Odua Museum and all of them. One can visit this building as tourists. Number 4. Mapo Hall Mapo Hall is a colonial style hall town in Ibadan City. It is located on top of Mapo Hill. It was commissioned by Captain Rose during the colonial era in 1929. Mapo Hall is important landmark to the natives of Ibadan and is visible from various parts of the city. The building was renovated in 2006 and commissioned by the former president of Nigeria, Olusegun Obasanjo. The hall is located in the other part of Ibadan town. The main entrance overlooks the Ogumala Street and face Mapu Road. The hall serves as a political and social venue in the city. It has serves as a venue for colonization of several others, and it contains pictures of past and present others. The palace of Ulubada of Ibadan is located a few meters away from Mapu Hall. Mapu Hall speaks of a rich cultural heritage and it is managed by the Ibadan Local Government Property Company Limited. One can take pictures and videos or go for a educational purposes. It costs nothing to enter Mapu Hall. Just make sure proper permission is taken from the caretakers. Number 5. IITA This stands as International Institute of Tropical Agriculture. It is the best and only protected urban forest in southwest region of Nigeria. It was established in 1967 with the aim of improving quality of tropical foods. The IITA Forest Reserve is a massive expanse of land designed and preserved to promote diversity. 
aside from the opportunity to observe protected and rare animals, the reserves offer other sources of fun and entertainment. Visitors can experience fun activities like camping activities, bed washing, picnics, and hiking. You can play golf, go biking, and fishing as well. It is located in Oyo between Ojo and Monia Town in Ibadan. It spawns over 350 hectares of land. Entering the facility is free of charge, but additional calls for tour guide and other activities. Number 6. Trans Amusement Park This is a fun park in Ibadan and is also called Trans Wonderland. It has a Wonderland theme and often referred as Nigeria Disney World. This is why it is on our list of places to visit in Ibadan or Hangouts. This is a park that features a lot of fun rides and wheels. There are numerous activities to keep you entertained and ensure you have a fun few day. It was opened in November 29, 1989 and located at Sangu Ojo, Ibadan. One can organize a picnic take pictures and chill. It is also very children friendly. The gate fee is just 500 naira. Additional expenses may be incurred when taking rides in a park though. It is best to visit this place during the weekend where families come with their kids. Number 7. National Museum Ibano. It was opened on the 12th of April 2002. You can't talk about the place to visit in Ibano without mentioning this place. It is located along Alonshinloye area Ibano. This is one of the best places to know about Ibano history. This museum is divided into four galleries. The Unity Gallery, the Masquerade Gallery, the Pottery Gallery and the Yoba Gallery. One can visit this gallery, take its street class, and appreciate other beautiful works of art. Gaining access into this facility costs you a ticket fee of 250 naira. Number 8. University of Ibadan Zoological Garden The Zoological Garden of University of Ibadan was built in 1948 by the University of Ibadan Zoology Department. This place is an educational learning, conversation and protection of animal and tourism. The UI Zoo is a great place to hang out and it offers to see a different animal and species, not to mention of the refreshed feelings of being outdoor in nature. The Zoological Garden accommodates various animals including various species of birds mammals and reptiles. Specifically, some animals you can find there include lion, ostrich, ox, alligator, giraffe, monkey, tortoise, and camel. And there are a lot of activities you could plan as you visit this zoo. First, it has a great picnic spot where you can relax and share meal in nature. You could arrange an excursion, snap pictures, and record videos play games and connect with the beauty of the nature. It is located in University of Ibadan, or your state, and open seven days in a week from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. It is home to numbers of animals, especially endangered species and plants. There are shops in case one gets hungry. It costs 500 naira for adults and additional 200 naira if you are using a phone to take pictures and 1,000 naira if you are using a professional camera and additional 1,000 naira for it all right. Number 9. Irefin Palace. It comes highly recommended in place to visit in Ibadan. It is located along Beregood, Ibadan. It consists of 130 rooms and it is presently inhabited by Irefin families. It was built by Joss Mod and Timber. This put people in her by seeing this building still standing. One can visit for sightseeing and also educational purpose. Taking pictures and shooting videos is allowed and it is open daily from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Number 10. Okibada Hill. This is an ancient historical landmark in Ibadan city. It is also part of core history of people of Ibadan. It is also one of the best places of interest to visit in Ibadan. It was formerly known as Eleyele Hill. And this hill is very much preferred among the people of Ibadan. It is considered a source of unity and protection among people of Ibadan. The Okibadan festival also takes place on this hill. The sight from the top of this hill is very beautiful. And the landscape of the city and buildings can be visualized from, from this hill. Number 11. Palm Shopping Mall Ibadan. Palm City Mall Ibadan was built in 2014. It is most common place you would visit in Ibadan and they are known for that. Visiting this mall, shopping is not compulsory. One can window shop, shop or take pictures. It is located on Liberty Road, Ibadan. Number 12. Ibadan Recreational Club. It was established in 1902 and it was known as 
Ibadan European Club. It is used to be an all British club in 1957. It changed the name to Ibadan Recreation Club. It is located at GRW. It was equipped with tennis courts, swimming pool, and a squash court. There are many restaurants and bars where one can wear one's clothes. It is a safe environment and perfect place to hang out and also perfect place for picnic. Number 13. Ibadan Polio Club. Polio Club is located at Eleyele Road. Polio is a game played on horseback. It is sometimes referred as horseback hockey. It is a beautiful scenery and a perfect for hosting event. One can also relax with friends and family here. As you have noted, there are a lot of places to hang out in Ibadan, and these places offer educational, excitement, motivational, and realization. The beauty of experience it itself cannot be fully pinned down. Why not take a step to check out this place and mention that exciting experience? Which of these places do you like most? Let us know in the comment below. And make sure to subscribe. See you in my next video. Adios.